Gardeners with strawberries, raspberries, and other cane fruit should be on the lookout for spotted wing drosophila, a tiny bug that's a big pest. A member of the fruit fly clan, this little bug lays hundreds of eggs in ripe fruit. Once they hatch, the larvae feed on the fruit, growing into plump maggots. With nary an outward sign, your luscious berry soon turns into a mouthful that's hard to swallow. This invasive insect is new to Colorado, but expanding its range rapidly. Currently, they've been reported in almost every U.S. state and are increasing in numbers in areas along the front range. Spotted wing drosophila is a small insect, only 2 to 3 millimeters long. The males have a characteristic dark spot on each of their wings, plus two black bands or tufts of hair encircling the lower front legs. Females have the appearance of other fruit flies, but their ovipositor is sclerotized with serrated edges to penetrate the fruit in order to lay their eggs. Unlike more common fruit flies that prefer overripe fruit, spotted wing drosophila feeds on and lays eggs in intact ripening fruit, making berries that are on the plant or have fallen to the ground a prime target. From egg to adult is a mere 8 to 10 days, depending on temperatures, and there are several generations per year. Populations of the Drosophila take time to build during summer, so fruits that ripen later in the season, like fall-bearing raspberries or ever-bearing strawberries, are most at risk. Blueberries, elderberries, currants, blackberries, peaches, and other fruit are attacked as well. Ornamental landscape fruits such as berries on dogwood, honeysuckle, mahonia, or chokecherry can also host the bug. In the garden, scout for spotted wing drosophila with traps made of yeast, sugar water, and soap placed in a plastic deli cup with a lid. Mix 4 teaspoons of sugar, 1 package of yeast, and 12 ounces of water with a few drops of soap. Drill or poke holes 3 sixteenths of an inch in size around the top edge of the plastic cup. Pour 4 to 5 ounces of this bait into the cup and hang in the shade at fruit height in the berry patch. The drosophilas are lured to the trap where they drown. You need to empty and rebate the trap every week. Do not pour out the old bait liquid on the ground as this will draw flies away from your trap. If you place enough of the traps out once the bug has arrived, you can reduce the number of adults laying eggs. For positive identification, strain the bait liquid through a sieve into a bowl, keeping captured flies in the sieve. Discard the bait. Fill the bowl with fresh, clean water, then gently dunk the sieve containing the flies into the water to rinse them off. Place the flies in a container with water and bring them to your nearest Colorado State University Extension office for identification. If you have spotted wing drosophila, outthink the insect by planting early bearing crops and make the commitment to pick ripe fruit often. Keeping the garden clean of overripe and rotten fruit can also help reduce the incidence of this insect. Eat the fruit immediately or store it in the refrigerator to prevent the bugs from developing. Destroy any fruit that has the maggots inside. Controls are available. Check with your local CSU Extension office for more information.